Hey folks, hello and welcome to the BodyCommerce video documentation and step-by-step -step guide. My name is Roby, and in today's video, I'll be showing you how to download and install BodyCommerce, then also provide a brief overview of the plugin and its various features. You'll find other great BodyCommerce resources on our documentation site at help.divyengine.com, which will also be linked in the description of this video. If you get stuck with more complex challenges, definitely feel free to reach out to our amazing support team and they'll help you find a solution. Now that that's all sorted, let's jump right to it. Alrighty, so to get started with our body commerce journey, we have to go download the plugin on the Divi Engine website. You'll head over to the Divi Engine site, log in, and then you'll find yourself on this screen you see up right now. You're gonna go ahead and click on the Mind Downloads button and that will load up and we'll get to the screen where you can go ahead and download body commerce. You'll see a few columns, all the plugins that you've purchased, and you'll just click on the button that says Divi Body Commerce in the download column and save it to a location you can easily find, where in the next step, we'll go ahead and install the plugin into our Divi website. So to install Body Commerce, we're gonna make sure that we're logged into the back end of our Divi site, and we're gonna go ahead and click here on Plugins, then Add New, As this loads up, we're gonna click on Upload Plugin, Choose File, and then we're gonna go ahead and select the Divi Body Commerce file that we just downloaded in the previous step from that convenient location, and click Open, and then on Install Now. And we wanna make sure once that's installed that we activate the plugin as well. Okay, good job so far. We've got Body Commerce installed. We still need to add the license key. Now, if you don't have your key handy, you're gonna go back to your Divi Engine account on the DiviEngine.com website. You're gonna go ahead and click on My Orders. And this is gonna take us to our order screen and you'll see the Manage License button on the right-hand side there. You're gonna click on that. And then with the next page loaded, you're either gonna scroll down to Divi Body Commerce and you're gonna select the license key or in this case, we're gonna scroll all the way to the bottom of the page and you'll see the key generator there. And if you have a lifetime unlimited license key or any of our unlimited licenses, you can generate a key right here. So you just click the drop down, select Divi Body Commerce and click the generate button. Now with your license generated or copied, just get that in there and then we'll head back to the back end of your Divi site. On the back end of your Divi site, you're gonna go ahead and click on Divi Engine then you'll see the body commerce settings right there. And what you're gonna do is you're gonna click on the last tab here that says license. Right here, you're just gonna paste your license key in there and click save. And that's it. Okay, so to give you a quick overview of the body commerce menu items, let's take a look here on the left-hand column on the back end of our Divi site. At the top, you'll see a Divi Engine link and when you click on it, you'll see a page with a video from our founder, Peter, that welcomes you and thanks you for your purchase. You'll also find other links to support, feedback, and any ideas that you might have that you can submit. Underneath that, you'll see the Body Commerce link, and this is where all the magic happens with Body Commerce. All the settings live inside a year, and we'll review those in detail in the coming videos. Underneath that, you'll see Body Commerce mods. Here, you'll find some additional mods that apply to your entire WooCommerce store, which are pretty useful when you really wanna get that custom feel. And right below that, you'll see the Body Commerce checkout fields. And this is pretty self explanatory. You'll add additional checkout fields right here. And that is it, folks. I really hope that this video helped you better understand the different steps involved with installing Body Commerce, as well as how to navigate its features. And again, if this video did not cover what you're looking for, definitely check out our documentation at help.diviengine.com and click on the Body Commerce link right there for more text and videos which will help you master body commerce. As always, definitely contact our incredible support team with more complex challenges that might come up and they will do their best to help you out. With that, this is Roby from the Divi Engine team. Thank you so much for watching and I'll catch you guys in the next video. Bye for now.